Howdy, true believers. This is your old pal, amateur artist Mark D. Chandler, coming at you once again from Manland. Funny story I got to tell you here. This is real life. It happened just last night. Uh, I had to work all day yesterday, and when I got home, guess what? I didn't pay the light bill. I ain't making that up. Lights were completely off. No light whatsoever. But did I panic? No, 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 no. You see, I have some of the basics to get by on. That's right. Backup plans, flashlights, oil lamps. I got it covered, buddy. I even had some special pork ribs that we cooked up there on that tin can burner I had made. Uh, Y'all ain't seen this one yet, I need to show it to you. But I designed it for larger cook pots like the one I've got at the house. Man, it came in fantastically awesomeness. But in the meantime, uh, during the lights out operation, I decided, a little bit bored, to go check the mail there at the apartments. And as I walked out there in my not quite my bare feet, I had my socks on. I peeped into the little mailbox. It's one of those flat mailboxes, kind of like what you see here, except it ain't that large, it's about that big, you know. And there inside that there container happened to be a little brown wrapped paper box. Now take a wild guess as to what it was. It was the flashlight I'd won from Soul Survivor X2, guaranteed. There it was, there in person. It finally made it. Well, it's not like it finally made it. It actually got here pretty daggone quick. And it showed up just in the nick of time. Boy, I grabbed that and a few of them other bills they had sent us, and I rushed back to the apartment, sat down there, and ripped that box apart. And the first thing I noticed was the cards that Miss Cindy of Soul Survivor X2 had sent me. Man, I was all ecstatic. I thought, yes, I have seen the light. What better timing? I need this flashlight right now. But when I looked at that angel of light there on that car drinking that there beer, I thought, yes, ma'am, you have just made Manland's Day. So while I was sitting there in the dark with my little AA flashlight battery flashlights that I normally use, I pulled out the through night flashlight. I'll show it to you. This is it right here. But as I dug deeper into the box, I realized there were no batteries. And you know what? These ain't the batteries you can just go down there to the dollar store and find them at. Mm -hmm. So here I am in a situation and I needed a flashlight real bad. I had it in my hand. But I didn't have the gasoline to sit there and run this thing with. Man, I tell you what, I was so disappointed. But it's not Soul Survivor's fault, none in the least. No, sir. -y. They sent me the light just as it was sent because it says in the description box there that little piece of paper, batteries not included. Don't y'all worry, none. I got the lights turned back on. They just couldn't wait one more day. Over oh, there at the uh, drugstore, they had them Durer cells, the right size and everything. So I popped them in there, and this is what I came up with. Didn't mean to blind you, and that right there happened to be on the low setting. That son of a gun right there is bright. But later on, I do plan on talking about this here flashlight a little bit more. But right now, I just want to let Soul Survivor X2, Cindy and her husband there, to let y'all know how much I appreciate this great gift. So to the famous YouTube channel that goes by the name of Soul Survivor X2, thank you, thank you, thank you. Until next time, this is amateur artist Mark D. Chandler wishing you and y'all a very happy YouTube experience. And remember this, unless you happen to be living with solar power or you're living off the grid, you still got to pay your light bill. The moral of this story is just like this right here. As I sat there and I had Cindy in my hands, and I was reading the note on the back of the card, and there she was, the angel of light, sitting there drinking that beer. I had her right there with me, with my wife right next to me, and there she was. I had Cindy, my soul survivor X2 right there. But the sad thing was, is, well, it's kind of like real life. She wasn't really there. I had the through night flashlight, but I didn't have the batteries. <laughs>
that's full of irony. <laughs>